Hello and welcome to Heart of Avocado. If you're new here, my name is Tapasya and I make new videos every Tuesday and Friday on topics such as minimalism, self-love, sustainability, finances, and more. In today's video, I'm going to be stuffing my cash envelopes for the month of March. So let's get right into my budget. So to start off with, I am using my Platinum Preppy Fountain Pen as usual. So here I have all of my categories written out for this month and I decided to try out this four column layout. So the first column here will be the amount that I will be adding this month and then the next column will be the balance of that envelope because for certain envelopes I will be rolling over the funds to the next month which is mainly for my sinking funds. And then this column is for the amount that I will have remaining at the end of the month and the amount that I will have spent at the end of the month. So gas is going to get 30 this month. Food is going to get 110 like last month because that worked out pretty well. Fun is going to get 15, the usual. Beauty is going to get 10, the usual. Toiletries is going to get zero again this month because I'm pretty well stocked on my toiletries. Restaurants is going to get 10. Miscellaneous is also going to get 10. Boyfriend is going to get 10. Annual is going to get nothing for now. Business is going to get 10. Car is going to get 10. Experiences is going to get 10. Uh... I skipped one. Clothing is also going to get 10 and then experiences is going to get 10. Gifts is going to get 15. Health is also going to get 15. And this health category has nothing to do with my medical expenses. This is more for like supplements I want to try out, protein powders I want to buy, things of that sort. So phone is going to get 30 this month. So my cell phone provider is Mint Mobile and basically the way they work is that you can buy your cell service in bulk in bundles of 3 months, 6 months or up to a year. The best thing about them is that their plans are super super cheap so I usually buy in bundles of 3 months for now and my monthly amount that I usually save is 25 per month but next month I will be renewing and I'm just adding in the extra $5 to account for the surcharges and taxes which is usually about 2 to $3 but yeah that's why I'm putting in 30 for this month instead. Also if you're interested in Mint Mobile I will have a link down below in the description box so you can go check it out if you're trying to save some money on cell phone service. Spontaneous will get 15 and then savings which is the carryover from last month I will be calculating at the end once I go through my envelopes. And the total this comes out to is $310. So let's jump right into my cash envelopes now. Alrighty, so here I am with my cash envelopes. I have my cash here, I have my sinking funds here, and I have all the envelopes that go in my wallet right here. So to start off, I'm going to stuff the envelopes that go in my wallet first, with the exception of groceries, which I will stuff at the very end. So restaurants will be getting 10. Gas will be getting 30. Fun will be getting 15. Oops, actually, looks like Fun has a five left, so I'm gonna pull that out. Fun will be 15. Beauty has two left, pull that out. 
and this will get a 10. Toiletries will get nothing. Miscellaneous will get 10. Let's see what we have here. So I have a 20 here. And I'm just going to be adding 10 today. Today is the first. Yes, 10. And then I should have 30 here. Almost forgot to put in the 10. Also need to remember to write all of this down. So the balance here is 30, 15, 10, 10, 30. That's all I've done so far. Boyfriend will get 10. That's nothing left. Now annual will get nothing for this month. Business will get 10. Zero, three, one, one, plus 10. And the balance will be 10. Car will get 10. Clothing will be getting 10. And I believe this is the first time I am contributing to this envelope. Experiences will be getting 10 and I have 20 in here. Zero, three, one plus 10 and the total is 30. Gifts will be getting 15. That'll be a 10 and a 5. Health will be getting 15. Let's see what I have. I already have a 10 in here. Adding 15. So that will be 25.
15 as well as this 10. Phone has 40, 50, and today I'm adding 30. So 20 and a 10. It should have $80 in it. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. Perfect. And now this envelope is funded for my renewal, which is so exciting. Um, okay. Spontaneous will get 15. Let's see what we have in here. I have $20 in here and I'm adding 15. which will put this at 35, 20, 35, yep, All right, now let's take a look at groceries. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 110. Perfect. This time I have exactly the amount I'm supposed to. So I'm going to disperse this to myself on a weekly basis. So I'm just going to give myself I think I'll give myself 30 for the first week since there are a couple staples that I am out of. And the rest I'm going to put away into this envelope. And I will disperse it as the month goes by. Have 30. Okay, now let's take a look at savings. So at some point in the month, I pulled out this amount from my envelopes and then I just forgot what it was for because I didn't write it down. So this is something that I set aside and this is going to go into my savings. And in addition to that, I have this left over. So let's see how much I have. So I have 20, 30, 1, 2, 3. So I have $33, and that is the amount I'm going to be adding to my savings. This is 0, 3, 0, 1, plus 33, and the total is So this is what the balances look like for this month. So that pretty much sums up this video. I have everything stuffed and ready to go for next month. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. I do have a lot of finance related content coming soon. So definitely hit that bell as well if you wanna be notified each time I release a new video. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will catch you guys in the next video.